you're looking for winter activities in Metro Vancouver, you'll find two major ski resorts. One of them is Mount Seymour. This is the place that you go if you want to just calm your mind. We are Ned and Max, and in this video, we'll show you how we explored Mount Seymour for the first time. <laughs> and enjoyed Vancouver's mountain top while sipping on some hot chocolate. Our day started pretty early to pick up some breakfast. Yeah. Nat has an obsession with ketchup. Of course, you can't begin a day without breakfast. And especially when you're going snowshoeing right now, we need some energy. As we drove up to the mountain, the rain turned into snow. Hey. Uh, do you guys happen to have a parking reservation today? Uh, we don't. But we do have uh, snowshoe tickets. Oh, but you don't have the parking reservation? No. I gotta park you down below. You oh. gotta make sure that if you're paying for snowshoe tickets, you gotta select that parking, otherwise we can't track the number of vehicles in the lot. So, okay. I'll get you, oh, somebody just left. Just right down by that VW. So around the barrel and on the right hand side. Perfect, thank you. you How's the weather out there? It's snowing quite a bit. Just tried to get out and get a feel of the weather because it's gonna be tough to snowshoe and film like this. It's quite snowing out here, but we're gonna have to live with it. Time to put on our shoes. She was raised along the salty sea, nursed on hope and fairy tale. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we're off. Even if it's snowing right now. I think there's still some good in this experience, right? I think we've been walking for the past 10, 10 minutes now, eh? Mm -hmm. So and one quick advice for you guys. If you guys are coming here to Mount Seymour, if you buy your tickets online for snowshoeing, there's an option there to purchase parking. And if you don't purchase parking, you're going to be walking 10 to 15 minutes because the free parking area is right over there. No, we have a snowshoe rental ticket. Do you know where you'd like to go? Not really, it's your first time. Yeah, okay. can we get a map? <laughs> yeah. We'll go out this building to the back. We'll go on your snowshoes, turn right. If you, for example, did a loop around the two lakes, that'd take you about two hours. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> One thing we noticed right off the bat is they have like newer snowshoes here. So it took us about maybe 5-10 seconds to put them on compared to the last time, right? Yeah. <laughs> the last time it took us about 10 minutes just to get in. Wow, look at the trees! Just the entryway to Winter Wonderland, look at that. We are welcomed by giant trees. Watching you walk my way I could just stop and stare for days. All of my dreams come true every day. You gotta somehow say hi to the forest before you come in, right? Yep. So you gotta shake their hand. <laughs> I can believe. I think this is the area where the beginners, snowboarders, and skiers, right? Sort of like their bunny hill. It's so nice here. <laughs> So I think what they do is they have like a conveyor belt over there and people line up to get over at the top of the hill and they just slide down here. <laughs> There's not a lot of people here today. So yeah. we have the whole trail to ourselves. So it looks like that when you're going on a blue trail it's a more narrower trail where the green trail is a more wider trail so they clear off the snow 
Mm. So you want to go blue? You want to go green? Green. Okay. Then we can just do the blue one going back. Yeah, I think we're going H. H is somewhat the moderate trail, so we can see the two lakes. How hard could it be, right? And also, the snow stopped a little bit. I think it's kind of misting, but I think the big camera can handle the sun. There's almost like walls of ice, a wall of snow right there. Look, the, the wall is as big as you. Taller than me. <laughs> it looked like clouds, right? There's definitely a lot of areas here at Mount Samer Snowshoe Trail that the snow is untouched. So you kind of see the snow piling up and it's still fresh. I've been waiting for this moment for so long. <laughs> I think we should make it a tradition that every year we have to go to a place like this and do a snow angel. Let's go. Thank you. You're welcome. The snow has started to fall again, and it's thicker this time. Did you hear that? What? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> this is the place that you go if you want to just calm your mind, you know, free from the hustle and bustle of the city. Mm -hmm. oh my gosh. Where's the lake? It's under the bunk of snow. So the cloud formations that we were showing you guys earlier is actually the snow pile on top of the lake. So like before, the fog has definitely started to kick in. So we can't see as much as we want to, but the beauty is there. I'm not sure if that's Elsa or Tarzan. <laughs> <laughs> the weather is definitely starting to come down on us here. Look how steep that is. It's so high. I got you! You guys could see the scale of these trees. Just look how small Max is. Forgot your glove! Get it! I'm tired! <laughs> How did that fall off my hands? <gasps> you did it! Here you go. It's so nice here! Look at the view! Uh, you found yourself a good little spot there, eh? Yep. I carved my own seat here. There's nothing I could ever do, could ever do to deserve you. There's nothing I could ever do, could ever do to deserve you. It's not that I'm such a bad guy. You're just out of my league. 
here's your hot chocolate from Starbucks, madame. Wow, special <laughs> delivery. Unfortunately, you can't see any view right now because the fog is just covering it all. But this is the lake. It's one of the lakes here in the trail. It's not really Starbucks. We just made some hot chocolate from home and put it into a hydro flask so it doesn't get cold. <laughs> Stays warm. Yeah, there you go. Mm. Nothing like hot chocolate on a cold day. It's good. I think the fog is starting to clear up. So you guys could see that like there's the trees there and this is the lake right here. Just before we leave, we discovered that this lake is called Goldie Lake. So if you guys are looking to do skiing or snowshoeing here in Vancouver, Metro Vancouver, there's generally like two ski hills, ski resorts that you can go. One is Cypress Mountain, which is the one that we went before. And this is Mount Seymour. Both are maybe around 15 to 30 minutes from downtown Vancouver. Made it back! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, we're finally there! All right, guys, that's gonna be it for this vlog. This day actually turned out pretty good. We originally thought that we were gonna make it because the weather wasn't cooperating, it was raining, it was snowing. Make sure you guys tune in for the next vlog because we are going somewhere we've never gone before and we are doing something that we've never done before. That's pretty exciting and I can't wait. But for now, if you guys are new here, make sure you hit subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you guys love it. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye. That's what we did, so I think we're gonna start walking. What do you think? Lashes. <laughs> so what's just more concerned about her lashes? My lashes wanted to go home. <laughs> oh. I guess this is the area for their... Oh. <laughs> <laughs>